We're live from Chevy Chase. Welcome back. It's now time for Talk of the Town, and today we're talking about a Halloween event happening this weekend over at Transylvania University. It's Pumpkin Mania, and it's back at Transy for another year of fun, frights, and food trucks. Yes. And here to tell us more, we have Vice President of Marketing and Communications, Megan Maloney. Hi. It is so great Welcome. to be here today. Doesn't that logo just look beautiful I here with you all? Yes. And we brought in pumpkins. Everywhere. Yes. Everywhere. So we're ready for you. We mm -hmm. are ready for Pumpkin Mania. It is uh, the 14th year wow. that we have carved over 500 pumpkins to put on the steps of historic Old Morrison on Trancy's campus. But this year, we're starting early. We've got a magic show uh, Friday night. We've got a concert, not only with the Transylvania choirs, but with the Great Crossing and Scott County choirs are gonna wow. come in and sing with us a spooktacular holiday or Halloween uh, concert on Saturday. And then, of course, on Sunday, we've got pumpkins. Yeah. Lots yeah. of pumpkins. Lots of pumpkins. <laughs> Man, it's a weekend full of events. It seems like know. every year gets bigger and bigger. Yeah, you know, it's just become such a wonderful opportunity for us to invite the community to campus. Not only our students and our alums and our faculty and staff get to take place, but it's um, really just become, we have families that come every year. Yeah. So again, we give away the pumpkins. We have ticketed all of them already. Oh, okay. But that doesn't mean that folks can't bring a pumpkin, carve it with us, put it on the steps. We almost always have people who have reserved one that don't show up, and uh -huh. so we usually have extras. But um, in addition to the pumpkin carving events, our student organizations and community groups will have booths. So face painting and a little bit of trick or treating, uh, fun activities for families. We do, as you mentioned, have uh, food trucks that will be there. This year, we're really excited. Transylvania's eventing team is going to bring their horses. Really? Because, you know, it's Lexington. Yes. What, what event <laughs> isn't a good event without horses? Yeah. So oh. our um, eventing team will have their horses there between 11 and 1 on Sunday. So it's just, there's a little bit of everything. Yeah. yeah. I love that you mentioned the families that come year after year. Like, your work creates these core memories. These kids will yeah. tell when they're 50 years old. Like, I remember going to Transy as a kid every Halloween, you know. Yeah. I, I, I have a kind of a nerdy question. Yeah. What happens to all the pumpkins when the event's over? It's a great story, actually. So we work with Black Soil Kentucky to help mm -hmm. us not only source the pumpkins, but to help us sustainably move the pumpkins on to their next phase. So uh, Slack Market Farm, which is here in Fayette County, will come on Sunday and collect all the guts from the pumpkins as we clean them out, because we do that hard work for everybody. Oh, gosh. And then Friday, November 1st, when the display is over, they're going to come back and take all the pumpkins to their farm where they use it for feed for chickens and cows and pigs. Yeah. Um, so it's, you know, we have really tried to be very sustainable in the way that we do this and ensure that the pumpkins can be used not only for families and fun, but also, you know, in a positive way afterwards. Yeah. I don't want to carve a pumpkin because the goopy part's the nasty, like pulling out the yeah. brains. But y'all do it for. We're gonna do that. Oh. that I so. do. This is awesome, and you're gonna have spectacular weather. Which We're gonna is have great awesome. weather all weekend. But again, it kicks off tomorrow. Yeah. We've got a magician and comedian coming in from Los Angeles by the name of Joseph Tran. That show is at Trancy at seven o'clock. It's gonna be another family-friendly show. The choir concert is at 2.30 on Saturday. That is a free performance. Transylvania's theater department has a show called The Moors by Jen Silverman, directed by Tasha Fowler, who's one of our, uh, our chair at the, in the theater area, is up and running. So we've just got all kinds of things going on. That's great. Pumpkin carving starts so at excited. 11, goes till four, and then they will be lit and up every night, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday through Halloween. Through Halloween. Halloween. And we will, the calendar works out this year that yeah, we get Halloween great. in there. It doesn't always work so out. So exciting. Okay, well, there you go. There are your weekend plans. Head on over to Transy and visit Pumpkin Mania. Thank you so much, Megan. It's been great to be here. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.